Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I am Clean with Barbie. Many many people were so curious about the messy room of this house. I have to tell you guys all night I was thinking about this room because this room was a very very scary for me. This was the room when we started to clean the living room and the bedroom and we used this as a little storage room and we put almost all the stuff in this room and this room was already very very cluttered. And I knew it, one day I definitely have to start to clean this room. When I'm editing a video like this, like an organizing video in a very, very cluttered room, I feel like the video is too dry. Here is have a lot of drama because I have to figure it out where to put all the stuff. But now really interesting moment like, oh my gosh, this oven is so greasy. So it's going to come off or not. It's very, very interesting. You know, guys, I'm living in New York and a many million of homes in New York. And almost all the clients, all the people who's asking my help have um, a cluttered room, not really a big dirt like grease or amazing black bathtub. I'm sorry if I say this, but I really enjoy cleaning too. But most of the home has the same issues like in this home. This room gave us a headache for me and the owner too. Because we was waiting for this room to be clean, um, for now her home is full with stuff, her bedroom and the living room. The positive thing is most of the stuff is organized and selected. But we had to go through on this room too. And here is all the stuff is together, not organized at all. So we have to go through on box and bags again. I want you to enjoy this video, but in the same time, I want to explain everything again and teach you because, you know, many people have the same condition in their home. Because I already know her home, I know her stuff not like my own stuff but you know on the third time it's my job is getting a little easy with like i know her stuff i know she has a lot of art craft okay and i know she has a lot of lot of papers um a lot of clothes this room was her son's room and nobody touched for a long long time The point is I want to leave this room kind of empty because now she can use her idea like where she wants to place her stuff. She told me she wants to use this room as an office and an art room where she can keep all the stuff what she needs for, you know, for enjoy her talented brain. And after when I'm done and I leave this room empty, she can figure it out what she wants. I did the same thing like usual. I collected all the clothes together, 
all the papers together, all the wireless cables, electric stuff together. Um, I found some toys here, so I put all together. She doesn't want to throw them away because that's memories and, you know, that's her son's stuff. I usually very very happy when I find a lot of empty basket or beans or or boxes but in this case I found a lot and I wasn't happy at all because I didn't know what to put in those baskets. I also want to tell you guys I am super super proud of this owner because um i visited her on the last week and i visited her yesterday that was thursday and she made a very very good job she started to organize um her stuff she put together all the clothes she um sent all her dirty clothes to the laundry um she organized her room the bedroom and um like she's really on her situation and she's really trying to fix it and this is such a good thing when i feel like they really deserve my help and they really can use my help you can see this is the part when i start to collect all the electric stuff together so if you have the same situation in your home you should do the same thing and keep them together If you have a problem to clean up your home and you feel like after a couple of minutes you don't know how to continue, you can see in me this video. Like sometimes I'm hesitating too. I have to think about it. Sometimes I need a coffee. I need a couple of minutes. I have to come out from the room and I need a break and think about it. What is the next step? because my brain is getting overwhelmed sometimes when my eyes see a lot of lot of things all them together and i know if i open a basket and there is a million different stuff in it and where to put them when the room is already very very busy and, and cluttered then i need some minutes you know a couple of minutes and after i'm just like i'm relaxing and then I can start over. Then I can think about it again to make categories, you know, okay, right now focus on the papers or focus on the clothes. What is the most of what she or the, the, the owner has in the home and focusing on that thing. Like here is, she has a lot of art craft. Okay, let's put together all the art craft for the first time, not touching nothing else, no papers, no cloths. So if you pick something like I want to continue with clothes, then focusing only on the clothes and then your brain and your eyes can see clear a little bit. Let me be honest with you guys, I don't think this video can teach you um, for anything. It's very hard to explain what I'm really doing because I'm touching a million stuff. Okay, not a million, but a lot of stuff. And here it's, I'm not going on categories because I'm recording, but at the same time, I want to be finished you know i can't spend the whole day and the whole night in this house and i have to focusing on the cleaning and at the same time i have to focusing on what i'm recording what you can see i'm running up and down in this room i'm touching um clothes i'm touching papers but because i already know where this goes it's easier for me but 
probably you can see through on this video. Probably this video is just um, good for motivation, like you turn on some video cleaning, organizing video on YouTube and you find mine and then, you know, you sit down in your room, take a bin, take a box and you go through um, talking about what I'm doing and great music and, you know, it's a little some picture that can motivate you to continue your room. Probably this video is perfect for um, give answer for some comments um, because on this week you guys left many many beautiful comments but again I don't have time especially on this week and the last week was very very extremely busy because after my post many people searched me and sent me a message and it's so interesting but they don't want my help for free they want to pay me so uh, they want their house organized and you know since my husband has a um, little break i can focus on my job and i want to make everybody happy but first my family of course um but it's just so good like people trust me so much and they want me in their house and they want me to clean up and organize their house but actually what i wanted to tell you this is the reason why i had no time for comments When I told um, the story about me and my husband, how he's supporting me and my job, you were all so nice and guys, you don't have to worry. I think every family has a problem for something and he was so tired sometimes, but he never had a problem with me or with my job. It just made our relationship more stronger. And I realized probably I solved the music problem because in my last couple of videos, you're really not complaining about the music. I have a different taste of music and this is what I show you. And some comment was very, very positive, not negative, and you're really enjoying. So that's a really good thing. you all enjoyed the longer video and it's so bad because now i can't give you a really long video as i told you it's very very dry and it's very hard to make an interesting video because most of the time i'm out of the room i'm not moving too much or you know i'm touching different stuff so hopefully the next video is gonna be a little bit longer and more interesting I'm also very happy about the comments because um, it's no judgment here. One, two is judging the situation or the owner, but most of the comments is very, very positive. It very uh, warm up my heart because you all supporting me like I'm doing a great job or my video was enjoyable. I did a great cleaning. I did a great organizing. My video was teaching you my video was motivated you to start your home and you got finished with one room or the kitchen and oh my gosh guys thank you so much you are all amazing Finally, I found the question if I bring my own stuff for this cleaning like mop, um, bucket and unfortunately I am not able to bring everything like mop and bucket because I already have a lot of lot of stuff so it, it, I need a 10 minutes when everything in the house and sometimes the owner has to um, help me to carry and bring all the stuff that I need. Um, um, 
usually they have a bucket or if they don't have a bucket I don't mind because I can use a pot or something it's, it's a plastic box I'm very fine with that and if they don't have a mop I I don't care I can wash the floor with my hand with you know a microfiber cloth with, with my hand with some hot water and soap and that's great A couple of weeks ago I told you the whole family got sick and as you hear my voice is still a little weird and when I got better Midwest Magic Cleaning Guy, I, I, I call him on this name not on the real name um, because this is how you know him, he got sick. So now he needs a good luck for a fast recovery. Someone in the comment um, asked me if I'm paying attention or batteries or not, what is old and you know it's a toxic and that comment was 100% right because I really didn't pay attention for batteries so I just threw them all in the garbage and in the future I try to may be more careful and um, you know collect them together. You all like that thing I'm not judging and if it's very natural of course I'm not judging so when I'm helping for these people how could I judge them in the same time I was in the same shoes I mean I, I my house never was like this but my mental health and everything in my life was very very bad so how could I judge them just because um, it has a sign in their house like the mess is a sign like they are not feeling well and this is the reason why I'm asking you guys who's watching my video to don't judge them because they are watching my video and I gave them a little hope but if I show for you their condition you easily can say oh they are lazy and imagine how they feel when they're watching the video and read the comments as i told you before it now used to happen really one or two comments what it says like um i also have a depression but my house is not looking like this and we have to understand not every situation is the same not every depression is the same someone is covering the depression very very good when you see they are beautiful beautiful they have a makeup on they are laughing when they you know on a party or somewhere but when they go back home the condition are very very bad and they are very very down
This is my hesitating moment. This is my favorite part when something is empty! And let me tell you something funny. I feel like I'm a gynecologist, okay? So the woman goes to the doctor's office with many problems. It's itchy, burning, and smelly. And we are all embarrassed because, oh, it's so not comfortable. And what he's going to think, what she's going to think about, you know, the smell and how it looks like. But the doctor is just wants to solve the problem. And it's the same with me. I don't care if it's dirty, I don't care if it's messy, I don't care if it's smelly, I can use a mask or, you know, I want to solve your problem. I want to give back the hope for you. This is what is important. After I clean out the fridge where is a rotten food, the smell is not going to bother us anymore. It's just like a couple of minutes or a 30 minutes. Who cares? I want to help you, not judging you, not bringing you in an amber situation. Before um, I'm visiting a house, people asking my help, they are not sure if that was a good idea to, good idea to ask my help. And sometimes they used to cancel the day with me because before I go, they're just thinking like, oh no, that's going to be too much. She's going to judge me. No, guys, no, I can't wait to see you meet with you see you face to face and let me start your room let me start your place let me help you i want to see in your eyes you can enjoy your home again this is what is important for me nothing else
If you like my videos, please like, share and subscribe. Thank you for watching. See you in my next video. Bye.